This video is exactly what you need right now if you're in a situation that can be described as I'm looking for what I want to do with my life. You know, I just, I don't know what I want to do with my life. Like, I have my life, you know, and I want to do things, you know, I want to be big and do cool shit, but I don't know what I want to do and I'm just kind of going to stagnate and not really do anything until I decide what I want to do. This video is for you, if that's how you are right now. Um, I'd like to start by explaining to you the, the basic core error. And yes, I am aware that Christmas is over. Um, I'd like to explain to you the basic core error behind that sort of um, stagnation, where you kind of don't know what you want to do with your life. You know, you know, you want to be this and you want to be that, but you need to be this and you need to be that. It's a very confusing situation and I definitely had my share of being there. But it all stems from the misconception that there is a, an absolute you. Again, it stems from the misconception where you believe that there is an absolute version of yourself, where there's an absolute uh, definition for who you are and what you do in life. Now, the problem here is that, let's say I decide that I'm a coach. That's who I am now. I'm going to be a coach and it's going to fit till it's not going to fit anymore, till I do something that breaks out of character. And that's where the resistance comes in where you decide, let's say, you want to be a business guy, but then you notice that it just doesn't do it for you, at least not fully. So you say, okay, it's not business. So you say, okay, maybe I'll be an author. So you start working towards that goal, and then you see, okay, that's also not absolute because I keep thinking of other things. Now, what I urge you to do is stop thinking about yourself as this closed, limited concept of I am this, I am that and realize that you are what you are at that moment and that's all that you truly are. What I mean by that is truly stop and think, what do I want to do right now? Do I want to create something? Do I want to write? Do I want to dance? Do I want to play the guitar? Uh, do I want to coach somebody? Maybe I want to sell something. What do you want to do right now, artistically or expression-wise? And that compass of where your intuition is leading you is who you are right now. But if you start um, putting labels on yourself and saying, okay, no, I'm this, I'm that, what's going to happen is the label is going to stick, but it's going to stick till it doesn't stick anymore, till you do something that breaks character. And that's where the resistance comes. What I want you to do is to stop trying to define yourself as a closed absolute concept because again, this is a misconception. There can be no such thing. The only thing that is absolute in this life is that life is meaningless and that you're going to die. These are the only two things that you can say with absolute certainty regarding your nature or the nature of life. Anything else is subjective and will change. So you could be a business guy today and tomorrow you're going to decide it just doesn't fit me anymore. Or the worst case scenario, you're going to decide I'm a business guy, but you're just going to start acting differently and that's where a lot of pain comes from. So what I urge you to do is to just let go of any misconception of who you are. There is no you. There is no you to define. Any you that you can think of is just a mental concept and just be who you are right now and fully express it and fully create from that place of intuition and trust that once you've created whatever it is you had the expression to create it could be a five minute expression or it could be a two month expression you could do a full uh, course that you build or you could do a full business or you could just want to do a small painting or just write something or or sell something it could be anything really and trust that once you did that expression fully and without any misconception about who you are, you know, you just gave yourself 
to whatever it is you want to do right now, trust that you'll be able to take this thing that you created and actually make money off of it. So let's say it's a lecture, you can sell that lecture or you can put it for free and then that will attract visitors which will actually uh, let you make money from views or make money from selling something that the visitors will buy. Let's say you do songs, you can always sell songs. Or let's say you want to write articles, you can use that for traffic as well. You like selling, start selling. Anything that you want to do, and again, this is for people who are more open-minded, uh, not in the nine uh, to five you know, job mentality. Um, you can truly be who you want to be. And who you want to be is who you want to be right now. Who you are is who you want to be right now. So avoid labeling, avoid absolutions, because any form of absolute concept is going to bite you in the ass again. Even the most deeply founded absolution, like I'm a, a good guy, I'm a family guy, everything disappears when you die. So no true absolute concept can remain. So why not stop defining yourself and start just living and being who you want to be at that moment fully and trusting you can use these assets that you build just like I'm using this video right now as a form of expression and then take that thing and actually profit from it by giving uh, a very win-win uh, type of solution where you provide value and just trust that the money will come if you just organize it properly to make revenue off of it. I hope this helped you. If you have any question, feel free to comment. Uh, this is the first time I'm asking this, but if you like the video, feel free to subscribe. I would highly enjoy it. And I'll talk to you soon. Peace.